I think everybody goes through times when they say, oh man, things aren't working right or things are going bad. And, and there were some things going on in my family and, and I found a rock. I was just sitting here holding this rock. You might see me carrying around. I found a rock, I stuck it in my pocket. And I said, you know what? Every time I touch this rock, I'm gonna think of something that I'm grateful for. And so every morning when I get up in the morning, I pick it up off the dresser, I put it in my pocket, and I go through the things that I'm grateful for. At night, what do you do? You empty your pocket, and there it is again. And I've had some different experiences with that. I've had some amazing experiences. I had a guy from South Africa, and then he saw me drop it. He said, what is that? Well, what's that? I explained it to him, so he started calling it a gratitude rock. Gratitude rock. Two weeks later, I got an email from him from South Africa. And he said, my son is dying from a rare disease. It's a type of hepatitis. He said, would you send me three gratitude rocks? Now, they're just rocks I found off the street, you know? So I said, sure. I had to make sure that the rocks were very special. And so I went out to the stream, looked, picked out the right rocks, and sent them off to him. Four or five months later, I get an email from him. Said, My son's better. Uh, he's doing terrific. And uh, he said, but you need to know something. He says, we've sold over a 1,000 rocks at $10 a piece as gratitude rocks, and we've raised all this money for charity. Thank you very much. And so it's very important to be in an attitude of gratitude, as I call it. 